right time. So let's get started. First, open up the terminal type by pressing Control T on your keyboard. Okay, now to type in sudo apt install python3. And this installs Python. And this is the programming language we're going to be using to make our quiz. So, we installed Python. Okay, now we can open up a VS Code window. And, oh, I don't want this VS Code window, a new one. Open just a new VS Code window. And then just click a new file. I'm going to name it vigo.py. Go to desktop, save, and place it since it already exists. Okay. Now, the first line we're going to do is a print. Welcome to the quiz. I'm just going to do it all caps. Quiz. And then we're going to print our logo. So to do that, just go to F symbols. I already have it open. And enter whatever you want. You can even put in an emoji, which I didn't try yet. Since Python cannot read emojis, they can only read them in black and white. So I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna type in Vigo quiz. And copy what comes up. Okay, minimize, and then just do a print like this okay place it like this or oh, just one line off don't worry it's just gonna do it all it's gonna make spaces automatically okay now we're gonna do a one two a lot uh three spaces and just type in plain equals to input and then do you want want to play and what input is it we basically get the user's data so do they want to play the quiz in this case okay so now we're gonna down here just click on enter if playing is not equal to yes to yes then print then just quit just do a quit okay now if the user does select s uh, if the user does select yes, then we're going to do a print. Let's play. And I'm just going to fix the invitation for this print function. Oops. There we go. Print. Let's play. And then we're going to start with a score that's equal to uh, zero. Okay, now we're going to put in our first question. So to do that, just type an answer equals to input. And then, what do you want the question to be? I'm just going to say, are you, I'm just going to do, a is a bunch of links based. Is a bunch oops. Is a bunch of Linux based. Okay. Okay. So let's do like if answer equals yes, then give them maybe a congratulations. If answer equals to yes so just say consistent you want double quotes or single quotes but you can use both i'm gonna use double quotes yes and you need two equal signs 
Okay, now just do like print, give it them print, correct. We just put it in the quotation marks. Okay, and now after this, we have to do a score plus equals one. Score, score plus equals one. You just have to do a plus equals one. Okay, let me just do that. Okay, now just do a else. Print incorrect. We want to say that it's incorrect. Print incorrect. So you can add now as many questions as you want. I have a whole bunch of questions in here in my old code. So I'm just going to copy them all. Okay, copy all of this code, all these questions, and just paste them. Okay, now let's just say how many, what the score in total is for the user. So let's just do a print. You got a score of and then exit our quotation marks but still in the brackets type in string and then score now let's rent okay we'll just do score Okay, I know why, oops, we don't need. And then a score of, and then our score. Looks like there's an error, let me figure that out real quick. And maybe I typed something that's not score. Uh-huh, print, zoom. You got, and then go out, just type in plus string, and then our score. There we go. And now we have to do a plus sign, and again brackets. And type in questions correct. Questions. Questions correct. Okay. Now we can run our code. And here we have do you want to play? Just type in yes. T is a bunch of legs based. Of course it is. Okay, it says correct. What is an OS? I'm just going to paste the answer since it's kind of long to type. And you can't easily get it wrong. So let me just... Okay, true. Does the PC have a CPU? Yes. And then correct. You got three questions correct. We just have to make a space maybe. And then you got three questions. Correct. Wonderful. Okay, now we're gonna do a control S and close. Now we're gonna open up our terminal in our desktop location. 
and type in the command and run the Python file. So just type in Python 3 and then the name of the Python file. I'm just, I named it like this, so let's run it. Okay, we get this huge logo that we downloaded that we copied from F symbols and here we go, welcome to the quest. Okay, we of course want to play. Let's play. Is it much leg space? Yes. Correct. What is an OS? Operating system. True. Does a PC have a CPU? Yes. You got three questions. Correct. Beautiful. So we made a simple quiz using Python. So if you want to see a part two where we make an even better quiz with functions and even elegantly written the code, just leave a comment down in the comment section. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. And with all that said, bye.